If you want to know who the most sought-after voters are in this election, you'll find the answer along this rural stretch of the I-4 corridor. There are so many independent or swing voters here in Hillsborough County that it's become a vital stop for every candidate. And in this election, independence could hold the key. In Plant City, they know a thing or two about growing crops. This is, after all, the winter strawberry capital of the world. And at the Parksdale market, people come from miles around to sample a delicacy that owner Jim Meeks is particularly proud of. You see these dark spots? That's all strawberry. We make our strawberry milkshake ice cream and strawberries. But for the last 30 years, this simple roadside market has become one of the most important political pit stops in Florida. And that's, that's my granddaughter. Oh, really? Yes, wow. my granddaughter. <laughs> The president looks a lot less grey than he does these days in this picture, yeah. right? Since 1960, the voters of Hillsborough County have backed the winning candidate all but once. And in part, that's down to the sheer number of independent or swing voters. And Jim Meeks happens to be one of them. He's never voted along party lines. Instead, he assesses each candidate carefully. And he's more than aware of the responsibility and the value of his ballot. I, I, I don't think I could handle being the person that decided between the two. <laughs> I'd rather be with some other people that do it, you know, because I would be, I was, if they did anything wrong, I'd be responsible. For Plant City's mayor, that independent spirit comes as no surprise. His family has lived here for generations, and he says the voters are a particular breed. They want to know uh, what's, what's best for the country, uh, and not necessarily their own self. I think they're looking at the community, the nation, the country that we all love so much. Plant City and Hillsborough County are effectively then a battleground within a battleground state. And that's what makes this part of the I-4 so vital. Andy Gallagher, Al Jazeera, Plant City, Florida.